And now our first look at the two-time U.S. national champions, Maya and Alex Shibutani. She's 23, he is 26. They've been on the world podium the last two years, silver in 2016, bronze last year in Helsinki. This is their first competition, so the first time the public is seeing their Olympic season programs. And right off the bat, so much personality. This is just really refreshing to see from these guys. You can see they totally bought into the concept. They, they worked hard on their Latin interpretation. You can see here on their rumba, their technical prowess is, is still in fine form. But man, what a great start to this program. Maya wrote a long blog for Team USA and she compared the short dance to an episode of Chopped. She said, you're given all of these ingredients and these requirements and a time limit, and then you've got to add your creativity and then really make something of it. I mean, they've, they've been so thoughtful about the way they've put this together. Absolutely. And, you know, oftentimes that thoughtfulness can sort of lead to looking over rehearsed. That is not the case here, and I think that's just a big part of their growth. This music, their attitude, the choreography. I, I have never seen them perform like this, honestly. Was right. Yeah. Effusive in my praise during the program. And I just, I don't know if I can say enough good things. It's, this is a Maya new Alex level for a team that has won the world bronze medal Maya last year. This, this to me is going to be challenging Papadakis and Cesar and Virtue and Moyer. I, I think this is absolutely going to be one of the best short dances of the year. One of my favorite Latin short dances I've ever seen, so. Wow, that is high praise. Yeah. Well, they have talked about how they have worked in the off season with skaters, with dancers, with musicians. They've been in Switzerland, they've been in Los Angeles, they've been in New York, and they've just, they, it's almost as if they've just not left one single detail untouched. No, absolutely, and, and here you can see, I mean, they're happy with their skate, but they're not. Yep. They're not going over the top. That means that they've right. been training this way. They're, they're familiar with how this program feels. Marina Zueva has done an amazing job with them this year. They have done an amazing job with themselves. Just the, the details, the attitude, the confidence and surety of their movement, the, the placement of their feet, edges, straight legs. The, 
with the musicality of their twizzle sequence. As we as we continue to say, they, they they're very thoughtful in their approach. They're not gonna they're not gonna let any of their elements um, sort of miss an opportunity. And and so often with their twizzle sequences, they put it exactly at the right moment, so as to sort of uh, just really emphasize how fast they're going, their speed across the ice. But most importantly for me, I think they look comfortable having fun. And, and that's not something that I've seen from them a lot. Right, that, that's a very interesting way to put it, right? Yeah. It, Looking it, comfortable having fun. Yeah, they just... So maybe they really are having fun. <laughs> I think so. I think so. Yeah, and a big smile from Marina there. She knows that... Again, first outing wow. and very, very close. Less than a half of a point uh, from their personal best as they scored back at the uh, Grand Prix Final in 2016. So that is a monster score, a great start to the season for Maya and Alex Shibutani. Absolutely. Yeah, six point lead there. That's huge.